Do you want to know why the world hates Jesus? Well, let me tell you why the world hates Jesus. The world hates Jesus for why he came, and that was to destroy the works of the devil. To destroy the works of the devil. Jesus and his kingdom is against liquor, against abortion, against pornography, against pride, against racism, against hatred, against selfishness. The works of the devil. That's why they hate him. Here's what Jesus said in John chapter 15, beginning in verse 19. If ye were of the world, the world would love his own. But because ye are not of the world, but I have chosen you out of the world, therefore the world hateth you. Remember the word that I said unto you, the servant is not greater than his Lord. If they have persecuted me, they will also persecute you. If they have kept my saying, they will keep yours also. But all these things will they do unto you, listen, for my name's sake, because they know not him that sent me. Why are we persecuted? The lifestyle we show, the lies we suffer, but primarily the Lord we serve. For my name's sake. Did you know that one of your gifts is the ability to suffer for Jesus? Philippians 1 verse 29, For unto you it is given in the behalf of Christ not only to believe on him, but also to suffer for his sake. Do you love Jesus? Then don't complain when the persecution comes. Because of him, for his dear name's sake. So here's the first point. Here's, here's what I'm trying to lay on your heart. Uh, we should expect persecution. Here's the second point. Not only should we expect persecution, we must endure persecution. <laughs> There's no way, really, that we're going to get around it. Now, let me tell you how it's going to come as you endure it. First of all, it may be personal insult. Look again, if you will, in verse 11. Blessed are ye when men shall revile you. <laughs> they love to revile you. You're going to be made the butt of jokes. You're going to be ridiculed. And now, you know, it's, it's actually reviling Christians is big business. There will be, there will be this, this, this reviling. There will be this personal insult, but there'll be something else. Not only will there be personal insult, there will be physical intimidation. Notice again as to what he says. Blessed are ye when men shall revile you and persecute you. 